All right, so we're going to um, get moving. And I want you to, because we have pulled down a little bit, we're just going to move without the music. Yes. Okay. And let's just move our arms around, get back into a little bit. Elena? Elena, that's my fault. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. We were just moving. Everybody was moving. Yep, keep so. going. That was my fault. Okay, we're back on. All right. So, just because when the music comes on, it has to be played so loud in order for you to hear it, I'm kind of yelling. So, when I'm bending, I'm bending my knees. That's my bounce. Little bounces look like this. Just bending your knees. So, we'll be using knees. Okay, arm movements, they will originate like from your belly button and going out. And when I say shoulder height, it's your shoulders. So that you, that's what I'm looking for, your shoulders. Okay, so we'll do things from the shoulders. Good. And we're gonna use our wrist because dance goes all the way to the fingertips. So today we're gonna to use our wrist in some of the movements. So we might go up and I'll say flip your wrist, that's a flip, okay? And this movement from this dance we're gonna to do today, this is pointing to the heavens. So I'll say point to the heavens and that's what that is. Okay, great. All right, here we go. So. We're going to just start a little bit. Let's just bounce. And open and close. 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 Now to your left. Open and close. Open and close. Open and close. Open and close. Great. And let's bounce. Let's try that again, four to one side, four to the other. Five, six, seven, eight, and open, close, open, close, open, close, open, close. Other side, you don't have to open so wide. I'm just trying to exaggerate so that you can see. You can open small and just work in the space that you have. Great. And let's add our arm movement. Three, four. Other side. One, two, three, four. Let's do that again. One, two, three, four. Again. One, two, three, four. Okay. I'm gonna put the movement together. So you bring your feet to your closed position and we're going to go to your right side and we're going to put it together. We're going to open and close it so that that close correlates with your feet coming together. And here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. And one, close, two, close, three, close, four. Of the side and one, Close and open, close and open, close and open and close. Great, very good, very good. Okay, I'm going to just, um, I'm gonna to move to another step. We're gonna put them together with the music. So palms down, palms up, palms down, palms up. Okay, here we go. So this is our ready position. We're gonna bring it out and turn your palms up when you pull them in. Yes, there you go. Down, up, up, arms out, arms in, arms out, and in, and out, and in. Everybody has it. Okay, so we warmed up our legs so we can go out and in. Bring it back up a little bit. Out and in, out and in, out and in. 
So we're just going out and in. Basic movement. Now let's alternate. So we're going to go out, back, out, bring it back, out, bring it back, out, bring it back. Let's add our hands. Five, six, seven, eight. Out, bring it back, out, bring it back, out, bring it back, out, bring it back. Great. That little bouncy movement, it'll feel really great, especially when the movement's on. So we're going to take this step and we're going to bring it out and now we're going to add a plie. So your level is up and down or you can say plie, it's a little bend in the knee. So we're going to go out, bend, out, bend, out, bend, out, bend. So I'll say out on the bring it back, you bend, out, bend, out, one more, out. Now let's add our hands, ready, and out, bend. When your elbows bend, your elbows come to your side, your knees are bending. Out, bring it back, out, bring it back, out, bring it back, good, out, bring it back. Now this step seems to go a little easier when you walk. So it's a step you can do in place, but if you have room and you can back up, you can walk forward. So when you walk forward, we're going to go out and we're going to bring this foot in and then that foot's going to go out and in. We're just walking and bend, step, okay? All right, here we go. Five, six, seven, and step, bend, step, bend, step, bend, step, bend. Okay, so. When I'm walking and I'm bending, right, I'm just moving. And you can also take it and step back. So whatever room you have. Let's do eight of those. Here we go. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now do another eight and just try to walk back to wherever you started from, even if it's only two steps. Ready and Go back, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so this is tricky going back. So that's why I don't like to use music in these first few steps. When you go back, you still step forward, and the leg that steps forward steps behind you, and that's how you travel. So you go step, pull it back, step, back, step, back, step, back. So the step will always go forward with your hands. Okay? All right, we're going to put the music on and we're going to try that. We're going to go eight up and eight back or whatever works for you. Because when we're doing Zoom, there is a delay. There's a natural delay. It, turn, it takes it off of a beat. So I may say uh, five, six, seven, eight, and one, we start together. There's a delay. So if you see me and you can work with whatever movement we're doing or you're watching anybody else, that's going to work. So we'll do A up, A back, and then we're going to add that step where we go to the side for four, the side for four, and we'll repeat it.
in low bop because it's an upbeat, fast rhythm. So. Hey, Elena, can I interrupt for just a second? I just, I meant to tell everyone at the beginning if they have not already, uh, already done this on their screen is to make sure that you have Elena on speaker view if, if so that you're seeing the full screen of Elena. Oh yeah, yeah. So if you have it on speaker view, when I'm talking, you'll just see me. If it's gallery, you see everybody, but if it's just speaker, then I come out bigger. Yes. Okay, great, great, great. Okay, so now, that energy that this song is giving us, you can hear the drums are going and it's picking up. So it's giving us a lot of energy. We want to keep that energy. So now we're going to add a turn. So I'd like you to watch first. We're going to add a basic turn and then I'm going to break it down so we all can learn it together. So we're going to do this turn and it's a clap. Okay, so let's learn it together. Uh, you're going to go to your right. For me, it's my left. You're going to go to the right. So feet together, yes. And if you don't have a lot of room, move all the way over to your side so you have room to turn. Okay, so uh, hands on our waist. We're just going to move our feet and then step out to the side. Now, when you cross in front, you're going to turn to the back. So take your left leg and cross in front and turn to the back. You're going to take your right leg and bring it back to the front. And then you yep, come to the front and that leg is out there and then you close it up. So I want you, here's another way. I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm going to march in place. So just watch. I'm going to go right, left, right, left. It was just a full turn, but I'm going to my right shoulder. Back, 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 back. That's our direction. So let's try that together. Just a simple turn. Ready? Turn to the back. One, two, three, four. Great. Now, that's the direction we want to go. So how big you turn depends on your the room that you have. When I add my arms, I'm just taking it with me. I'm going one, two, three, four. So when I add my arms, it's kind of hard to add, add your arms and not go anywhere. So I just want to open it a little bit. Same direction. We're going one to the back, to the front, together. Now let's try the other side, whatever, whatever side you didn't do, okay? So I'm going to be going to my right, so that's your left. Let's try that. Let's step one, turn to the back, turn to the front, clap together. Yes, so four, we're gonna use four. So here we go. Let's do it to your left again, on a count of four. You don't have to go far, you can turn in place if that works for you, or you can move wider. Five, six, seven, eight, turn. One, two, three, four. Okay, and remember, my clap, I have a little delay when you hear it, there's a little second in between. So here we go. Let's do the arms, ready? One, two, three, clap, four. Excellent. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, clap, four. Now you, you try to incorporate that into your turn. So your one, that's when your hands go out, okay? So let's try it together. Five, six, seven, eight. Turn. One, two, to the front, and four. Okay? So let's try the other side. Ready? And turn. One, two, three, and four. So when your hands come together, I can see it, then I know that's our four. All right? So let's do a spin. A spin, a spin is the same thing, it's just fast. So watch my spin. That's my spin. Okay. So, ready? We're going to call this step we're doing a spin. Five, six, seven, spin. One, two, three, spin. Now 
Now go the other way when you get there. Excellent. Okay, here we go. Now let's take the slow one because the slow one is actually a dance step. So slow, right? The slow one, we're going to go one, two, three, and clap. Other side. One, two, three, and clap. Now spin. Now we're going to spin. One, two, three, turn. One, two, again. One, two, three, turn. One, two, three, turn. Excellent. Now, if you get dizzy, what I want you to do, you can jump up and down, or you can just do like a calf exercises where you're going up on the elevator on your toes. If you get dizzy, you can go up and down, or you can just jump a little bit. Okay? So here we go. So this step has two slow turns and four spins. Let's try it together one more time, and then we'll do it to the music. Here we go. Two slow turns, and we really see your arms, and four spins. Five, six, seven, eight. Slow. Out to the back, to the front, clap it in. And out to the back. Looking good. I see spinning. Now spin it. Turn it. One, two, three. Spin it. Get your four half turns. Excellent. Okay. Good, good, good. So we have our, our spinning done. All right, here you go.
go a little bit over. So we're going to do two steps, and we're going to get into like a pull down type of move. Okay? So this step is a scoop step. We're going to scoop and go forward. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, and then I push the air back. Everybody ready? Let's scoop. Two, three, four, push it back. Four. Now you have it. So now when you scoop, go that way, but on an angle or straight to the side and scoop. Two, three, four, and down. Four, and scoop. And down, two, three, four. So that's our scoop step. We're going to scoop, and then we're going to imagine us all in a circle. So for me, I have you on a gallery view. So we're going to be in a circle, and when I call your name, give me any step that you want. And the step that you do, I will do, so we all will do it. So it's as if we're dancing in this big Spencer Town circle, okay? And I'll call your name, and whatever you do, then we will do it. The and we'll go around. Okay? People, uh, the people that are on YouTube. And that, and that's how we're going to end. Yes, Kelly? I'm sorry to interrupt. I have everybody on mute right now. Maybe this is the time for everybody to unmute themselves. Yes, that would be great. Great, great. <laughs> okay, right. So this is going to be, it's just our cool down, our cool down, uh, cool down dance. So remember, imagine we're in a circle. We'll do our scoop step together, our big scoops with our scarf. We'll do that together. And then we'll start in our circle in the middle. And when we're done, I'm just going to stretch out as we end.
palm on your elbow, your elbow on your knee, and bring that hand up in the air. Open your chest, that's what you want. You're stretching out chest. And come back down. Go to the middle. Roll your shoulders out. Circle them. Go the other way. Bring your feet in. Bend your knees and straight. Bend your knees and straight. And just come up. Great. Roll your shoulders back. And go forward. Just shake everything out. We did a lot of movement. That was great. Thank you all so much. Let's bring it in. Thank you so much. Well, I hope you see you again. Thank you. And you yeah. we're doing some drumming. Hey guys, I, I'm, I apologize. I put everybody back on mute. It's just mostly to, so like we don't have background noise, but do you have questions for Elena? If you want, uh, go ahead and unmute yourself again. Oh. Any questions for Elena? Elena, that was just fantastic. And I was wondering, um, do you have any upcoming programs or presentations that you want to tell us about? Uh, I'm currently working on uh, doing a virtual series uh, here for the Carver Library. And um, there's a lot of collaboration. So sometimes it's the Carver Library, the Hudson and Philmont. And I definitely um, would love to add you into the loop so that we can put it out as a collaboration and, and bring everyone in. Um, I think, I mean, I think you probably have Cynthia's contact information um, already, and I can give you the contact information of the others if you don't object. Yes, that would be fantastic. And it's good sure. to you guys. Sure. I'm, sure, uh, I'm sure everybody would like to know what you're doing. And I, I know that my screen was off, but I was doing it too. And I was like, that was so fantastic. Thank you. That was just wonderful. Um, I just want to say a couple of words about um, upcoming things at Spencertown Academy. Um, you did meet Greg Mosley, and we haven't set our date in October yet, but that will be an October program about uh, Greg's expertise and about Afro-American drumming. It's just going to be fantastic. So we're really looking forward. Thank you. Um, so what a, what a benefit that he gave us a little uh, taste test of that. Coming up in September, Spencertown is doing its virtual online um, festival of book series. We have some wonderful authors programs also coming up on September 5th and 12th uh, for kids. We have um, Jacqueline Rogers, who's a noted um, author, children's book author and illustrator, who's going to be doing readings and workshops on two successive Saturdays. Then on September 19th, we're going to have a pre-recorded program with the fabulous Steve Charney. Um, it's all about books and he's a ventriloquist and a composer and a comedian. Um, so that's some of what's coming up. You can see it all at spencertownacademy.org. If you have any questions about today, um, some of you know me, you can just send it to me directly or you can email info at spencertownacademy.org. So that's all the adverts. Thank you very much. Um, Elena, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Some new faces and some old faces because it's a small county. You see everybody is wonderful. I just want to say I am doing the Sankofa Black Arts Cultural Festival. It's virtual. It's on Facebook. If you like that page, there's information for everyone. Uh, and I want to, since we're doing dance, there are um, some um, dance companies, Harambe Dance Company, when, when um, we put things up each day. There's a performance with Harambe Dance Company. There's a, a Dorky Nelson, West African Dance and Drum. So each, every few days, you'll see different things. If you like dance, and there's also wonderful topics for children and a children's book. And I do want to say Dr. Stevens is with us. She has a, a children's series also. And uh, hopefully we'll find out more about her book and what she's doing and sharing the Gullah culture with us. Um, she's also a dancer too. So there's a lot of things that we have people in, in, you know, in our county and wonderful organizations like Spencer Town Academy, which is really bringing all of this in. So thank you so much for having me. And if you can jump on our page, there's something for everybody. I hope to see you again. Have a great day and a good weekend. Thank you.